We all have doting parents, don't we? Have you ever felt that you were being over pampered? Well, the person who receives the pampering never feels it, and the same applies to the one who pampers their loved ones. This is the story of a lady who always pampered her pet dog named Tricky. She even failed to realize that her pampering was affecting her dog's health and made him sick. Do you know what happened to the dog because of the pampering? Was our narrator, who was also a veterinary surgeon, successful in treating the dog? Let's find out in the story, A Triumph of Surgery. The story begins with Mr. Harriet, who had pulled his car over and saw Mrs. Pumphrey walking her beloved dog, Tricky. Since Mr. Harriet was a veterinary surgeon, he was very concerned about Tricky's health because he had become very fat. Mrs. Pumphrey, the mistress, sensed the wet's concern for the dog. She started explaining why she could not refuse him food despite being suggested otherwise by the wet. She said, He was so listless, Mr. Harriet. He seemed to have no energy. I thought he must be suffering from malnutrition. So I have been giving him some little extras between meals and a bowl of horlicks at night to make him sleep. Nothing much really. With concern, Mr. Harriet asked if Tricky was doing any exercise and got to know that Tricky was barely doing any physical activity. Mr. Harriet looked at the dog again and assessed that the dog is very unhealthy because of his greed for food. Do you agree that Mrs. Pumphrey was showing her love and concern through food? Let's see what happens next. After a few days, the vet received a distress call as expected from Mrs. Pomfrey. When he went to her home, Mrs. Pomfrey explained Tricky's situation and said that he had refused to eat anything and had bouts of vomiting. The vet told Mrs. Pomfrey that Tricky needed to be hospitalized at that very moment as there is no other way to save him. Reluctantly, Mrs. Pomfrey made lavish arrangements for Tricky's stay in the hospital. She sent many blankets and beds, utensils and toys and what not. For a couple of days, the wet kept Tricky under observation, giving him no food but plenty of water. Later, he presented him with some food. Tricky was kept with the other dogs. The wet did not give him any medicine, but allowed Tricky to play with other dogs and do all the things that any dog would do normally. With this kind of treatment, Tricky had a speedy recovery. Meanwhile, Mrs. Pomfrey had been sending luxurious meals and other expensive food for Tricky. However, Tricky was not given any of the things his mistress had sent. The wit and the staff feasted on the items sent by Mrs. Pomfrey. The story ends on a humorous note. Mrs. Pomfrey was overwhelmed by the speedy recovery of her dog and showered all her praises on the wet. She said, Oh, Mr. Harriet, how can I ever thank you? This is a triumph of surgery. There are a couple of messages we can infer from this lesson. Overdoing anything is hazardous even if we do it due to affection. The dog was overfed out of love and that made him sick. Secondly, greed is harmful, be it of any kind. The dog was greedy for food and had to face the repercussion of its greed. Thirdly, Sometimes it is very important to say no. Our parents say no to us for certain things. We fail to understand their reasoning at times when they say it is not good for you. But in reality, all that the parents want is the best for their children.